Have you ever noticed that the tools used by astronauts floats? Well, this video has the answer for it. Hi everyone, so in the previous video we discussed how Newton formulated three basic laws of motion. Today's video is about the first law. Newton's first law of motion, sometimes referred to as the law of inertia, states that an object at rest stays at rest and an object in motion stays in motion with the same speed and in the same direction unless acted upon by an unbalanced force. Or simply we can say that everybody continues in the state of rest or of uniform motion in a straight line unless it is compelled by an external force to change its state. So here there are two parts. One is that which predicts the behavior of the stationary objects and the other is that which predicts the behavior of moving object. These two parts are true if this condition exists, provided that the individual forces acting upon the objects are balanced. And this property of an object at rest to stay at rest or of an object in motion to stay in motion is known as inertia. There are three types of inertia. Inertia at rest, the inertia of motion, and the inertia of direction. Now, imagine you are practicing for a 100 meter running competition on a track and your sports teacher suddenly asks you to stop immediately within a second. Will you be able to do it? The answer to the question is a no. Yes, you can stop but only gradually. And guess what? It's the same story with every object. Every object keeps on doing what they are doing. If it is at rest, it will remain at rest. And if it is in motion, it will stay in motion. But what can change this? Yes, only an unbalanced force can change this. If it is at rest and an unbalanced force acts on it, it will move. If it is in constant motion, and an unbalanced force acts on it, it may accelerate or change its direction. And this is nothing but Newton's first law of motion. Here is the reason why the tools of astronauts floats. They can only place them in space and stay in one place, as there is no force to intervene to change this situation. The same applies when they throw some objects. These objects move in a straight line. So, if they drop an object while in space, that object will continue to move in the same direction and at the same speed unless interfered with an unbalanced force. 